Hey everyone, it's James again here with the PyCombot development team and I wanted to make a really short video on a really cool feature uh, that's going to enhance your your marketing abilities here when you use PyCombot. So as you guys already know, PyCombot 9.0 is uh, released on November 1st, uh, 2016 and it's coming out strong with a lot of new features and one of the coolest features in here is a feature that's in the posting module and this feature is a short code feature uh, so you can actually make custom footprints or excuse me custom short codes for the messages that you send out to people so how does this work it's really 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 simple um, you'll see a button down here that says add short tags and when you click this button, you have to select a file that you're going to choose. The file is going to need to be a CSV file. Um, when you upload it, and after that file is chosen, then you'll click the Use Custom Shortcode button when you're running before you start running your your posting campaign. Now, what you need to do in advance of doing this is you have to create these shortcodes. So, how do you do that? Very simply. All you have to do is open up any type of uh, workbook and uh, as you can see here I already have data kind of pre-entered here so you can see. So as you can see I have four unique columns filled out here and uh, what these columns uh, represent uh, essentially are your short codes and how it relates to a website. So you can notice that I have in the first column the URLs listed here. Now these are going to be URLs that are contained in the list of websites that you're going to be contacting with PyGumBot. Uh, there is a static uh, code you can use as well if you just want one universal short code and that's going to be uh, this right here. It needs to say non-match. And so when it says non-match and then you write your short codes just like the ones above here, uh, what this does is if there's not a URL or if it comes across a URL that's not contained actually in here, it will be listed as non-match and then whatever short codes you write out throughout these fields will be inputted into the content of the message that you are sending. So I have six sample uh, domains in here that you can see and six sample service offers in here that you can see as well as six sample offer links. In the first column, you list your URLs. Now the way that this works is uh, you can come up with any of the short codes uh, that you want. Uh, it doesn't have to be any standard uh, short code. Uh, PyGobot still has its basic short codes that you can use in it, uh, but these are going to be ones that you feel maybe you want to create yourself. And as you can see, I've uh, created three uni unique short codes and I have these short codes applying to the domains that are listed here and for the example I've kind of bunched two domains up so you get a better feel of how this is going to work let's say that you have lists that contain uh, for example three different types of services maybe even in three different regions of the country. Maybe you have lists of, of companies in Miami or companies in Seattle or com companies in Kansas City, Missouri. Uh, and maybe you have different offers that you want to promote to these companies. So the way that you do that is you first put a title up here in column, uh, excuse me, row one, and then you put the actual content of the message that you want inserted uh, into the following ro rows. Now service offer is going to relate to uh, any of these fields here. So when it comes across do uh, one domain.com, when you use the short code for service offer, it's going to insert plumber marketing service and so on and so forth. So domain three would insert, insert in the message uh, if you use the short code car dealer marketing service uh, and the same rules apply for the offer links so when it comes across this domain if I use the offer link short code is going to insert the the link for that that's associated for that uh, domain uh, again 
the exact same thing with the short code that I've created here titled region. Uh, anytime it comes across this domain or any domains that have this in it, um, it's going to insert the name Seattle into that where that short codes used. So on a practical level, let me show you what this is going to look like so you guys maybe get a better uh, grasp of, of what's going on here. Because I know some of you are more advanced at marketing uh, than others. Some of you are just starting out. Uh, but what I can tell you is that this is a very, very powerful feature. So in this example, I've just written out a really basic sentence that you can see. Uh, it says, if you can look at our hashtag region hashtag, hashtag service offer hashtag, by looking at our portfolio here, hashtag offer link hashtag. Now what this is doing on their websites when they're filling out their contact forms, it is it's associating with this hashtag that you've created up here for region, the regions that I've entered underneath. So when it goes to, for example, domain one, it's going to insert Seattle in region and plumber marketing service and service offer. Uh, you have to use the hashtag symbols, uh, some people call them pound symbols, uh, before and after. Um, and you can name these anything you want. So if, let's say for example, um, I am going to uh, change region to area, then in my message I'm going to type out hashtag area hashtag instead of uh, region. It's really that simple. So this is how this feature works and you would save of course this uh, file to your to your computer and then after you have uh, uh, saved that file you just click this button right here add short tags you would choose your file and then you would make sure that uh, the custom short code was used by clicking that button and you would hit test short codes. Uh, if you wanted to see what it would actually look like, you can you can test that out. So, really cool feature. I hope you guys like it. You'll be able to do so much with it. Uh, anyways, you guys have a great day, and keep on keeping on with your marketing.